So, welcome back to tutorial number three, where I will show you how to bring Flans mod into the just compiled MCP. So, where to get Flans mod? Well, we need the source code, which is located on GitHub. GitHub is a coding base where coders post their codes and other guys can help with coding and so on and so on. So, let's have a look at Google and we're looking for a github. Here we go, github.com and we're looking for flans mod. So this is a page from a flans mod on github. Here we have a drop down to select different branches. A branch is basically a version. You need the latest version so you have the latest source code. Currently we have master, teams, development and 1.7. So let's have a look. Master last changed mm, two months ago. That's not so good. Uh, 1.7 24 days ago, uh, also not good. Teams, oh god, a year ago. And development, oh, 20 hours ago. So, we will take the development branch and download it. How to download? Well, quite simple. Just pressing download zip. So, download is starting, it takes about 5 megabyte, and finished. So, what's next? I go to my download folder here, and have a look inside the just downloaded file, which is called Flans Mod Development. Inside this file I will find Flans Mod Development as a subfolder, and inside we have a jar and a src folder. So, I will go now to Forge and have a look inside MCP. You will notice there is also a JAR folder and a SRC folder. What we do now is quite simple. We just take all this stuff and copy it inside the MCP folder located into Forge. You have to overwrite some stuff. That's okay. And basically that's it. We run recompile again to see if it works. Finished. And we run start client. And, well, as you can see, you have weapons, you have planes, you have vehicles. So, basically, that's it. You are now ready to build models. In the next tutorial I will show you how to set up Eclipse, which is quite new for most of you. And yes, see you soon.